Welcome to my first vegetable garden. Today I'm going to show you how to plant seed potatoes. These are Yukon Gold, $3.98 for eight seed potatoes. And when you go to the store and buy them, they're going to be small size. I'm going to put them into this container. I'm going to show you how to set everything up. You want to make sure though when you buy them that the potatoes can be soft. You can squeeze them. You can see that they're starting to grow some stalks right here. Be gentle with them. Try not to break them off. This is where your greenery is going to come out. But you want to make sure none of the potatoes are rotting. When I went and bought these today, um, some of the potatoes in most of the bags were rotted. So they smelled bad. They had those fruit flies around them. So you want to make sure you inspect the seed potatoes. First thing you want to do is you want to put about four inches worth of prepared soil in the bottom of your container. You're not going to fill this up to the top. You're going to fill this in stages over the next really um, four to six weeks. And I'll explain that to you. But first thing is four inches of soil. And the way that I do it is you can buy a pre-made potting mix if you want. This is my old container soil. So I'm just kind of getting it ready and freshening it up for a year. I have a video on how I prepare my container soil. But you want to do about a 50-50 ratio of organic matter. I use peat moss and your old container soil and just mix it up and again you're going to press this down and you want about four inches that's not even quite three yet and you can see roughly it's about 50 50 for potatoes it doesn't have to be perfect all right so that's going to be about my four inches I'm going to add in a quick handful of lime, mix that in. Potatoes don't like acidic soil, peat moss has some acidity to it, the lime will help that out. And then I've actually lost, oh malfunction here, I lost my tablespoon, so, oh here it is. So I'm going to put in a tablespoon of 344 organic fertilizer, a tablespoon of blood meal, and a tablespoon of bone meal. And that's just going to prepare the soil for the potato. You can use synthetic fertilizers if you want. It doesn't really matter. What I recommend is just measuring by a tablespoon. The tablespoon tends to be less than it's recommended, and less is usually better with fertilizer. So pack this down, and that's gonna be your starting base. Let me give it a measure. Yep, that's about four inches. And you're gonna put in your seed potatoes. Now potatoes actually, you want to put up um, where the sprouts are. Just loosen a little bit, set it in there just like that. This probably will be able to take five potatoes. Again, the eye side up where the sprouts are. Even though these are small, you can see them right there. Now potatoes form growing upward. So what's going to grow down into this is the root system, not the potatoes you're going to harvest. I'm just going to go with four. You could put in a fifth one. I'm going to put in about four inches of soil across the top of this. And then when the greenery grows up six inches, I'm going to add in more soil over the season. Um, yeah, over the season. So the reason you do that is because the potatoes, when this is a green stalk up to here, the potatoes are actually going to grow out of the green stalk. So you want to slowly raise the soil. Now I prepared some soil earlier. It's already got the fertilizer in it. And I'm going to put about four inches on top of that. You want a loose soil. There's organic matter in here like the 50-50 mix. Don't press it down. You want the potatoes to be able to form easily. But that's all you do to get them started. Water it in. You want to make sure you keep your potatoes uh, soil. Keep it. Uh, damp. You don't want it to be soaked, but they really do need moisture. And again, when the um, greenery gets to about six inches, I'll add soil into here. Then when it grows up 
you know, another six inches, I'll raise the soil up to here. And this whole pot will fill up with potatoes. And I'll do videos showing you how to do this as that progresses. Hopefully you have an idea of how to start seed potatoes. I'm also gonna do a video on planting potatoes in five gallon buckets from a uh, grocery store. Just label it and you're good to go. Hope you enjoyed the video. Please check out my blog at www.therustedgarden.blogspot.com and also check out my YouTube videos. Thanks.